Jesus, this is Pastor Bert for our daily breath, daily devotion. Before we begin our devotion for the day, let us pray. Father in heaven, thank you for giving us life and health together with our family. Thank you for the power, the strength, heartbeats, and the power and uh, good health you're giving to us and to our families, relatives, and friends. Let's continue to trust you for healing those COVID-19 patients from COVID-19 war to be healed in Jesus' name. Um, the COVID-19 worried will be emptied and they will go back home reunited with their families. Cases in the Philippines will go down and down and down in Jesus' name and will go back to our normal lives. As we pray for sick people who are suffering from tumors, cancers, um, uh, heart diseases, kidney disease, uh, liver ailment, uh, blood diseases, psoriasis, tuberculosis, asthma, um, Alzheimer's disease, Depressions and anxieties, rebuke the healing in Jesus, rebuke the sickness in Jesus' name, claim healing upon healing, upon healing from hand to the sole of the foot. Thanks for healing, Brother Duncan. Thanks for healing, Sister Nancy Zara. Thanks for healing us all, everybody, giving us a physical fit body. Thank you, Jesus, and pray. Amen. Yes, we share the word of the Lord today in Psalms 84, verse 4. Blessed are they that dwell in thy house, they will be still praising thee. All right. And you know, this repair will refer to the house of God in his tabernacles and courts. It refers to the priests and Levites who are frequently officiating there in their turns um Gabit Arao no at sa mga taga Jerusalem noon. And even today sa atin, pinalala po sa ating lahat na happier those who have a name and place in the church of God, who abide there and never go out. Blessed are the righteous. Hallelujah. Blessed are the righteous. And they will be still praising thee. It is a delightful thing for praise is pleasant and family, you know, mga kapatid. Which is when you continue to engage as the uh, mercy of God pour upon us day after day, especially on Lord's Day. You know, Lord's Day. Uh, worship celebrations, public worship. Such a bless and praise the Lord. We receive both for temporal and spiritual blessing as long as we live. That's why we really miss face-to-face -face worship gatherings. Face-to-face -face worship gatherings. And this Sunday, we will begin our face-to-face -face worship together with the youth. And uh, we'll pray that little by little, all the adults will also be uh, having it until we are combined in our gathering, little by little day after day as we love to worship the Lord worship in uh, his presence back to the heart of worship Jesus it's a really great thing to have this experience in the worshiping together and lifting the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and hopefully all churches will have all the experiences to open up once again gather together gather safely and uh, to worship the Lord the King of Majesty the King of our hearts that's why we claim for the past two years, when we've been uh, bombarded with fear, and we also really have that anxieties about what happened to us. But now, God is doing His work, lowering down the cases, and the government has the would soon announce alert level two as we claim, and the economy also going to be open for those businesses and employment who are also going to have the opportunity to get boom once again as the churches will also boom once again and to win souls and make disciples and glorify His name. To all the believers of Jesus, get excited. Uh, get excited to praise the Lord in His temple. Of course, we can worship the Lord everywhere, but it's really a great experience uh, to gather to gather in a worship uh, center or a venue which we have all the believers of Jesus gathered together, seeing praise and worship, who listen to His word. I just want to thank you for Pastor Eric for giving us time and guidance and also praying for us all the BDSC people thank you very much for the youth and the adult alike and see you uh, this Sunday as we glorify God as we never forget this reminder for us blessed are, they, blessed are they that dwell in thy house they will be still praising thee God bless everybody and see you all soon thank you Father in heaven, thank you very much for a reminder for us today. We really love to praise and worship your name corporately 
in uh, in a church, in a church venue or a venue in which all the believers just got to be gathered together once again after two years. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you for all the brilliant. Thank you for Pastor Eric and the missions and the, that he believed in all the churches there together with him. Thank you for blessing him and blessing his family at the same time and continue to uh, guide us and empower us as we continue to live up your name. Together, we worship you forever. And we go back to the heart of worship. In Jesus' name, pray. Amen. God bless everybody. It's my believers. This is the BTSC. See you all this summer. We're all excited to dwell in this house and to praise his name and give him thanks. Thank you and God bless. He's possible for uh, our dear breath. God bless you. Thank you. Bye.